Hello everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I want to be teaching you how to download and install Inventory Sorter for Minecraft 1.14.4. Inventory Sorter is a long-standing mod that uh, is pretty cool. It allows you to, well, sort your inventory quickly and easily. As you can see, middle click, sorts, and then the mouse wheel in and out allows you to move one item in and out of a chest at the same time. So pretty quick and pretty easy sort of setup, but it's a very, very helpful mod that can really make uh, things easier in Minecraft. It's a kind of like quality of life mod is what I would call it, basically making quality of life in Minecraft just a hair bit easier. First and most though, we do have a message from our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Host. You can go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to get an incredible 24-hour DNOS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. We actually love Apex so much that we host our own server, play.breakdowncraft.com on them. So again, if you are looking for a great Minecraft server, Apex Minecraft Hosting is the only place to look. You can check out Apex again at the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and get inventory sorter installed. To do that, you want to go to the second link down below, and that's going to take you here. This is the inventory sorter download page, basically the official mod page here. And then if we look on the right hand side and scroll down, we'll see Minecraft 1.14 under recent files. Then you'll see this green R here, and if you have that green R, you can then go ahead and click on the purple download button next to that green R, basically, version there. When you click off that, it will take us off to a page where your download will begin in five seconds. And after five seconds, the download will begin in the bottom left. You'll then want to click keep on the file, and it's safe to do so as long as it does say inventory sorter in the title, which ours does, so we can click keep. If you're on Mozilla Firefox, it's popped up in the center of your screen, by the way. You'll need to save the file in the center of your screen on Mozilla Firefox. Now, we aren't done downloading just yet. We still need to download Forge, and to do that, you can go to the description down below, specifically the third link down below. It's going to take you here. This is our official tutorial on how to download and install Forge, but we're going to be going over all this in this video, except if you have some issues, there are some things that like this tutorial goes through that we might not cover here just because we don't want to go too in-depth. I mean, overall, you shouldn't have any issues in going Forge, but if you do, this article can help you out. But once you're here, just click on this green Download Forge button. That will take us off to Forge's official download page, where we want to make sure we're downloading the 1.14.4 version of Forge. To do that, make sure it says MC 1.14.4 here. If it doesn't, go ahead and click on the plus over here on the left-hand side, and then click on 1.14.4. Then you'll see this right there, MC 1.14.4. And then, under Download Latest, go ahead and click on the Installer button. It will then go ahead, take us off to Add Focus, where you don't want to click anything, stop, don't click anything on this page. If it asks for a notification, click deny, don't click anything. Your download's not ready, it's lying to you. Just wait, 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 wait. And then in the top right up here, you'll see a red skip button. Don't click anything else on this page except that red skip button in the top right. And then when you click on that, it will download Forge in the bottom left. Now you will need to keep this file, but it's pretty important to make sure it does say Forge in the file name. In our case, it does say Forge here. So we can go ahead and click keep. If you're on Mozilla Firefox, it's gonna download in the center of your screen. But again, make sure that it does say Forge in the top title before you click save on Mozilla Firefox. Now if we go ahead and minimize our browser here, on our desktop we have Forge and we have Inventory Sorter. If these aren't on your desktop, no worries, they are in your Downloads folder. And to find them in your Downloads folder, just click on the Windows icon. It's in the top left for me, but it's probably in the bottom left of your screen. But whether it's in the top or bottom left doesn't matter. This little Windows icon in the top or bottom left of your screen. Click on that and click on Downloads, or type in Downloads, I should say. Then you'll have this Downloads file folder in Windows. When you click on that, you'll have Forge and Inventory Sorter in here. Drag these to your desktop just for ease of use. Kind of glitched it out there, but there we go. Drag them to your desktop for ease of use. Once Forge and Inventory Sorter are on your desktop here, we can start off by installing Forge. To do that, go ahead and right click on it. Click on Open With, and then click on Java TM Platform SE Binary. If you don't have Java TM Platform SE Binary, or if you do and you click OK and it doesn't open anything, no worries, we have a solution for you. In the description down below, you'll have this tutorial, how to download and install Java for Minecraft mods, Minecraft servers, etc. We're installing the Inventory Sorter Minecraft mod, so this is where you want to come to be able to download and basically get everything working to allow us to open up Forge with Java. So go through this tutorial, it's a very simple three-step tutorial, and it should work. If it doesn't, we have a solution in the description down below known as the Jar Fix. And what this does is basically make all the .jar files on your computer work with Java once again by just repairing them and making them work with Java again. So yeah, go through this tutorial here, it'll fix everything, and then it'll make your jar files work on your computer finally, allowing you to right click on Forge, click on Open With, and then click on Java TM Platform SE Binary and click OK. This will then open up Forge's installer here. We just want to click on Install Client and then you can go ahead and click OK. It'll now go through, download, and do everything that it needs to do to get Forge installed in Minecraft 1.14.4. However, if this doesn't work, if it does fail, you don't get the success message that we're about to get. 
guess what? All you need to do is go play Minecraft 1.14.4 with no mods, no anything. Just launch Minecraft 1.14.4, and then this will work. However, as you can see, successfully installed Client Profile Forge. Awesome. We're good to go ahead and click OK. Now, Forge is installed, which is cool because you need Forge for Inventory Sorter to work, but we're trying to get the Inventory Sorter mod here after all, so let's go ahead and install that. To do that, go ahead and click on, again, the uh, top left for me, bottom left of your screen, that little Windows icon in the top or bottom left. And then once you've opened that on up, go ahead and type in Run, R-U-N. You'll then have this Run app here. Go ahead and click on that Run app, and then in this Run app, you're going to want to type percent app data percent percent sign app data percent sign right here in this text box exactly like that and then whenever you've typed percent app data percent in there and clicked ok it will open up our roaming folder here and then in our roaming folder we will have a dot minecraft folder go ahead and open up your dot minecraft folder and in here you will have a mods folder but nick what if i don't have a mods folder what do I do? Well, no worries. It's no big deal. All you need to do is go ahead and create one. So right click in this white space over here, create a new folder, and then title that folder mods, M-O-D-S, all lowercase, exactly like that. Then when you've got your newly created mods folder here, double click on it and drag and drop inventory sorter into your mods folder. Boom. Just like that. Now, you might be like, is that it? Is it installed? And it is, but we need to make sure that we're opening up the correct version of Minecraft to, you know, play it correctly. So let's go ahead and open up the Minecraft launcher here. Just the normal Minecraft launcher that you're used to. I have to do a quick little update and open it up in a weird space. Let's get this all spaced out here. There we go. All right. So once we're here, all we want to do is click on this little icon to the, your yeah, this little like drop down icon to the left of the play button and then click on Forge. Now, if you don't have Forge here, what do you do? Well, don't freak out. It's perfectly fine. I'm going to show you exactly how to fix that problem. Just click on the plus new here. See that plus new? Go ahead and click on that. And then you can name this whatever you want. I'm going to name it play.breakdowncraft.com. And then for version, this version drop down box, go ahead and click on that. And in here, you want to find release 1.14.4 Forge. See, right there it is 1.14.4 Forge. Click on that. I'm going to go ahead and change my resolution. And then we can go ahead and click create. Then I have this awesome play.breakdowncraft.com profile under it. You see it says 1.14.4 forge. Highlight over it and click on that green play button there to go ahead and open it on up. And then we'll be good to go. We have now installed inventory sorter in Minecraft 1.14.4. As you can see, right there it is. Deep scan of inventory sorter complete. Awesome. That's a good thing. Now, it's that's a new thing about Forge, by the way. If some people, you know, have not installed mods in a while, they might be like, what was that? Basically now Forge does a pre-launch before it actually launches Minecraft, and that's what that was, but now it launches Minecraft a lot faster. So here we are, we can go ahead and click on mods here. We'll see simple inventory sorter. That's it, that's our mod. However, it's not working until we jump on in here. That's a preview of a seeds video that we actually posted yesterday. So go check out that video if you're interested in the best Minecraft survival seeds currently available. This one's pretty cool. It's gonna literally spawn us like right there over a uh, like a, a mansion here, like a woodland mansion. But what's cool about that is there's a village right over here. Pretty cool seed, right? You can check out that video in the description down below on uh, the best Minecraft seeds. But let's go ahead and go into creative really quick. And then I'll just jump down here. And all of these are 1.14, by the way. Look at that. How awesome is that? <laughs> but nevertheless, let's go ahead and give ourselves a chest. And then we will give ourselves a bunch of items and different things that we can throw into this chest and make quite a mess with because that's what we're wanting to do right we're wanting to make quite a mess with everything we put into this chest so we'll do that and then we'll do like this right here and basically we just want to just to sort everything nicely here and make sure that it is in fact working boom and then we'll do this to here and then we'll put a chest in there so now i'm going to go into survival and then we should be able to open this up and click our mouse wheel oh sorry scroll the mouse scroll is what moves them one by one here so if we scroll our wheel here there you, so you can see it adds them there takes them away same thing there adds them there takes them back now in order to sort things it is a middle mouse click which isn't actually going to work for me because I have some other keys bind to that. So what we can do is actually come in here to controls and then we can find in here the inventory sorter thing. As you can see, middle button is already bound, so it's not going to work for my inventory sorting. But normally you just click the middle mouse wheel on your keyboard there and it would uh, it would work perfectly fine. However, for us, let's go ahead. H1. There we go. So now if we come back into game here, we can press H and there we go. It sorts everything. You mess it up again. Go ahead. Press H and it works and it fixes itself perfectly. 
and easily. So yeah, there you go. That is it. That is how easy it is to install Inventory Sorter in Minecraft 1.14.4. If you have any questions about Inventory Sorter, let us know in the comment section down below. If we did help you out, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. My name is Nick. Come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. We have Greek Protected Survival Custom Skyblock. You will absolutely love it. Over 100 players online every single day. Actually, more like over 150 players online every single day. But as you can see, there it is. Play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Can't wait to see you online. My name is Nick, and I am out. Peace.